I love everything about the School of Computing and IT and mainly the lecturers. I mean, it's so easy to talk to them about anything. It's so easy to gain more knowledge. They're all very, very knowledgeable. So yeah, I think I, I really like that part a lot. The quality I like most about most lecturers at the School of Computing is how willing they are to help the students. The lecturers will do more explanation in detail to us to make sure that we understand the particular topic. I normally meet my lecture on one-on-one -on -one session. Uh, it, it basically after, uh, it can be after class or um, by appointment. I can talk to them about anything at all. Even after classes, I can ask them about anything. I can ask them about the subjects, group work, assignments. It's really easy to communicate with them. What I love about being a student of SOSIT is that the lecturers give us the opportunity to work on actual projects that allow us to have experience. I really enjoyed practical IT skills and introduction to computing. These two subjects involve lots of uh, programming and uh, scripting. Require technical skill and logical thinking. I actually appreciate the amount of practical work that we have as it helps me apply all that I've been taught. The the project itself is based on the real-life situation. So we, we learned quite a lot about designing websites, building your own simple programs and all that, and it was really interesting. And also helps me to manage the amount of time I have to work on each and every assignment. My passion is in creating applications, and so these subjects help fuel that fire further. Okay, we've had like lots of talks already so far, but the one that really, really fascinated me was to talk by the Google Head of Malaysia. I mean, how often does the Google Head of Malaysia come to a campus and give a talk about something? His talk was really, really eye-opening. He gave us like, he, he, he explained to us about what life will be like once you graduate, what Google employers are looking for. So yeah, it was, it was a really good talk. Well, last year, a few course mates of mine took part in the MSC Malaysia IHL Business Plan Competition a competition which involves the generation of commercializable concepts and they won first place last year. This motivates me to work harder so that I can achieve works of such levels or higher. Taylor's School of Computing and IT also offers the Bachelor of Software Engineering Honours and also the Bachelor of Computer Science, Computer Security and Forensics. Uh, these two degrees are dual award uh, with the University of West of England, uh, Bristol, UK. What the dual award means is that students have the opportunity uh, to complete all three years of their program here at Taylor's and they are able to get the um, certificate uh, upon uh, completing the three year program uh, at Taylor's University. They have the option of travelling um, to the UK, to Bristol, to complete the final year of their study and uh, they would be able to get both the Taylor's University as well as the University of West of England uh, degree certificate. I love um, the discussion room in the library because it provides, um, you can sit there with your friends and then you can do your assignments or your exercise or anything. As the exam period comes closer, I tend to spend more time on campus studying, so the 24-7 room allows me to stud form group study sessions all the way until midnight. The facility that I like the most is definitely the sports complex. I usually play futsal over there with my friends, so it's a really great place to play. And um, I use the gym quite a lot as well. The gym is really well equipped. It's, it's a really good place. Our programs are technical and it's also industry relevant. Uh, we include the industry advisory panel members uh, to basically provide us uh, inputs on the curriculum that we have developed. This is to basically ensure that our graduates, once they complete their program with us, uh, they are job ready and they are able to meet the demands uh, of the industry. Uh, last year, I worked on a system for the Centre of Research and Development and that really opened my eyes to the kind of work that is involved in our field. Okay, so in the foundation here, we were exposed to lots of programming languages and um, processing tools and all that. So, I think once we graduate, you wouldn't face a problem using all these tools since we were already exposed to it at a very, very early stage. So yeah, I think it's, it's, it's great. We wouldn't face a problem at all. 